Hey, welcome back to Gaming Fixation in Borderlands Pre Sequel, talking to Pickle. Davis Pickle. Good to meet ya. Yada yada, what you got? <laughs> Spring says you're trying to get your mitts on some military AI. Well, it's your lucky day. You can half inch one from the Drakensburg. I hear the bosun and the skipper who run that place are well known collectors of rare and nifty intelligences of the artificial persuasion. Sweet. Uh. Trouble is, it's not like you can just walk right up to the place and ask to have an AI. No shit. Really? We'll see. <laughs> Cocky, eh? Fair enough. They're a tricky pair, but maybe they'll let you on board right off the bat. I'm updating your echo with the most direct route there. I bet they won't. His voice sounds. Sound. I've had my eye on that wreck for a while. And Where you going you? in for a bit of a look see would <laughs> let me do a bit of shopping myself. Dun, can I, can I steal your echo recorder, please? No, you can't. Sorry. Uh, All right, so, to. yeah, this kid's voice sounds familiar. Like, I should know it from some other voice role that I've Where's, heard somewhere. I can see that there's supposed to be huh? vending machines somewhere, but I don't see them. Um, well, well they can't be up, so. down here? There they are. Yay! Okay, let's buy some ammo since I ran out of that. I really should have, um... I think his name's pronounced Pical, though. I really should have gotten like a bigger bag and better ammo holding thing when we were at the Concordia from the black market, but I didn't, because I forgot. Shoulda, woulda, shoulda, coulda, woulda. All right, let's go on. Okay, Cross so cross bridge to the Drakensburg. What is a Drakensburg? That's, That's a the name of a giant ship. Okay, is it in? Is it flying or is it landing? No, nah, it's it's crashed. Oh, unfortunate. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it crashed. So, and the guys there theoretically have an AI that we can use to re lead our robot army. Awesome. Let's steal it from them. Oh. After murdering them. Here's a fast travel thing. Lee? Do you want to go do black market really, really do you, quick? If it'd be helpful, you might as well. All right. Hey, welcome back. We can now magically hold 300 more pistol ammo, and our bag has gotten larger. What was our capacity for pistol ammo before? 200. Now it's 500. Wow, okay. A yeah. juicy wreck, all right. x -style frigate, don't you know? Bay stuffed with tech I could half inch pinch. The bosun and skipper have been good at keeping me out, but now you're here. That's about to change. Okay, I'm gonna get a real sniper rifle because I'm Pickle has a, a big giant shit eating grin on his face. Yeah, like that picture is what I was like. Oh, he looks a bit like Ender, not huh. you know randomly when you could see him okay. as a normal <laughs> I was, kid. I was wondering with the helmet. what exactly it was about him that was so Endery. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's just the dark. I have no idea. He just made me think of Ender from Ender's Game. Which is an awesome book, and everyone should read it. Yeah, or and then listen the to it. To like it are I did very different on audiobook. But <laughs> Ender's Shadow is good. Yeah, that was where were we? We were driving back we from were, Las Vegas. Yes. Yeah, and we listened to the entire audiobook of Ender's Game. It was, and it, it like it took, ended perfectly. Like we had yeah. to sit in the car for like ten minutes or something. Once we got home, maybe to finish like it that. up. Maybe even not that long, but like it was almost perfect. It was fun. Okay. So, off to the Drakensburg. They're, these are just the coolest things. <laughs> like, I, I don't... So this is replacing normal mod. explosive barrels? I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Yeah, bloody harvest <laughs> barrels. I think they're just normal explosive barrels, but have pumpkins all over them. I really should use those more, too. It's like, use my mini-map, use the barrels. So many things I can... Oh, yeah, I'm supposed on, to be paying whatever. attention to that for you or something. Eh, no, you don't have to. <laughs> Let's kill the kragans. It's more fun and interesting when you get ambushed from behind. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Or when you're unable to shoot them as they're running right towards my face. Okay. That as well. Into your mouth. Nope. How am I... Okay. They don't like eating bullets. They do not like eating bullets. Very few things actually enjoy eating bullets. It's unfortunate. Yeah. I don't think I know anything in real life that would enjoy eating bullets either. What well, depends if the bullets are being fired from a gun or if they're just eating them at, like, oh, that's sitting true. on the ground. That's true. Because I'm sure there's creatures that eat just metal. Yeah. It could be Wait, like, like bullets? real creatures? Well, I doubt real creatures. Maybe. Like, I mean, I, mean, I, I bet dogs could eat bullets and just be like, oh, whatever, but they wouldn't enjoy it unless you, like, covered it in peanut butter and tricked them. But, like, when we're talking about, like, oh, my gosh. Okay, so, what? quick story. My my dog that we had when I was in high school, um, she was adorable, but she liked to eat rocks. Oh, my goodness. And, like, she just would... We thought it would, like, mess up her digestive tract and stuff, so yeah. we tried to, like train her out of eating rocks and one of the things we tried to do is we coated a bunch of rocks with tabasco sauce oh. and we placed them around the backyard so that she'd go out there and she'd eat them and she'd be like oh this is horrible but she she had one 
And then she really? tried hunting down the other ones that specifically had Tabasco <laughs> on them. So she liked spicy food. I guess she did. Oh, that's so cool. She also funny. liked to eat cheese whenever we had cheese that we were making food with. So, but yeah, it's just that. So that didn't work. Um, eventually, I think she just kind of grew out of it. Uh-huh. <laughs> but yeah, it was just the funniest thing. That's pretty good. I miss Die. my dog. She was cute. Yeah, we had a dog that used to eat rocks, but we didn't have a fun story for it. She was just crazy. <laughs> Yeah, we had we'd have to leave her in our backyard and stuff, and she would just like it was she had a harness on, mm-hmm. and so and we tied her up in our backyard with the harness, and she had a lot of like leeway because we didn't want to like you know just abandon her there kind of a thing. Uh-huh. But um, I remember once I came home from school and my dog had jumped over the fence while attached to the harness, and she was just kind of hanging Whoa. there like half over the fence because <laughs> she was still on her harness. But so it was a good thing we didn't put her in a collar because that yeah, would have been say. she could have died. But. Man. Yeah, we eventually had to give her up because she was just too way too crazy to handle. It was sad. But then we got an amazing dog called Jake, and he's still alive, but I don't have him with me anymore because he's at my parents' house. Do you think you'll ever have him with you? Um, Probably not, just because he's really old now. Uh-huh. And so we probably don't want to... I don't know, if they if my parents do move back over to where I am, mm-hmm. they'll of course take him. They're not going to like abandon him to die right, or something. Right, right. But I think he very well might pass on due to old, old age before they move, so... Mm-hmm. Rip, Jake. Hopefully not, though. I we have you, Jake. We'll yeah. never forget you. I have pictures of him on my desktop and stuff. He's also my phone background. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of info you didn't need to know. This Sorry. would be a perfect place to insert a picture of Jake if we wanted to yes, do that. we could. We, we can show happen. my pretty picture of Jake. <laughs> he, I have a lot of pictures we could use, yeah. I don't oh, know if wow, I... Oh, wow, a savage... Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh wait, terrifying. savage. Is savage worse or than Or scavage badass? beast. I'm not sure. I think it might have said scavage. Scavage beast? Yeah, because these guys are called scavs. So but it is it a be beast like, or is it a person? It's it's a person on a beast. Oh, oh, scavenger beast, I see. No, just scav beast. Oh my gosh, that's kind of terrifying. Die, creature. Don't shoot the floor. I'm not shooting the floor, I'm shooting them. <laughs> I think you were for a second. I might have been for a moment. Okay, I'm going to keep hiding. Good plan. <laughs> Crouch. Okay, nobody's up here yet, so that's nice. They're still hanging out down there. We can kill this thing. We'll get you, you mini boss. If you if you defeat You'll his, never defeat me. If you defeat his beast first, oh. maybe he'll be so sad at the loss of his friend that he'll uh Nah he's still shooting me. Oh, oh my mind. goodness, I'm gonna throw a grenade down there. Oh hiding. Hey, I think you might have killed someone that time. I, I did. I I saw a little one hundred three EXP show up. Oh, okay. Die, 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 die. Yeah, there's the writer. He did not care that we <laughs> killed his friend. I think he cared in the most angriest of ways. Uh, I'm not gonna die, though. Like, he's gonna stay here and I'm gonna kill him. Yeah, he, there's no way he's gonna run away. Yeah. He didn't, though. So I, I, I was correct. Oh, he just melted into a pile of goo. Yeah, that's what freeze Ooh. weapons are. Good cryo weapons are amazing, because it can just, like, freeze the person there, and then you can just shatter like them. Instantly? There's another one. Uh, not instantly. I mean, there's a percent chance of whether okay. or not it'll actually freeze them. Little scavenger beast. Okay, come on. Just Too- why, why am I doing, like, nothing to that thing? There's hmm. something down there that's... Yeah, there's something down there that's low. I'm gonna fire at it, and hope hopefully. And it dies, maybe. Oh, boy. Okay, I might switch you weapons. You can do it. You can... What? It, why isn't it dying? Apparently, they're just invincible creatures. That is so <laughs> annoying. Like, I guess they were frost, so I switched to my pistol, but my pistol didn't kill it either. Like, I don't even know. Okay, they well... They level a billion scavenger beasts. This is a tough mission, I think. I'm still, like, not... A great level for this, but... See, but like you told me that even if... Like if you, uh... I can hear they are. What in the hell? Are they invincible? No, okay, here we go. I'm just not shooting them. Well. That's weird. Maybe you have to shoot them in the not armor. Probably. Oh my gosh. How accurate... I already broke like, my shield. My so- shield is crap right now. <laughs> How sophisticated is the the hit spots and hit detection on creatures in this game, anyway? Uh, I have no idea. Cause I, well, <laughs> I'm just <laughs> I, I don't know what the. I'm just wondering if this game, like, if the uh, like, if it would actually matter with how much, cause there's a bunch of places where there's metal and there's a bunch of little gaps. Like, if that would matter. Um, probably they've. There are some creatures where it's like you have to hit them in specific spots to do crits. Hmm. So it's probably pretty sophisticated. Oh, you took revenge. They're all dead now. He's gonna so. pickle my what? Uh, pickle your face, maybe? Oh, that's a little spooky. 
<laughs> Whatever. At least we respawned like two feet from where we were. So yeah, that seems nice. to happen a lot. I it's, like it's, that. It's, yeah, it's nice. It's like, you died, you lose some money and go right back into the fight. Okay, I'm just going to come down here and I'm going to whip you in the face. Oh, and our objective's right over there. Like, the entrance to the ship? Yes? Yeah. Cool. But then it'll be, you know, go through the entire ship right, right. and then go through an entire different area and then 80 billion other things. <laughs> but, alright, let's head in. Pickle. Don't, don't touch oh, our, don't our, touch our stuff. <laughs> Alright, let's go touch all of their stuff the in things. the next Rub episode. Rub our face on it. Yes. <laughs> Thanks for watching.